Hi everyone, it's Mrs. Ferguson. Today we're going to be working on Skills Unit 5, Lesson 12. And by the end of this lesson today, you should be able to say short vowel sounds, say letter sounds, read the tricky words, and choose the correct spoken word. We're going to start today by saying our short vowel sounds. You ready? What short vowel is this? That's right, eh. And a way to remember the eh sound is by placing your finger below your lips like this and saying eh. Let's do that three times. You ready? Eh, eh, eh. Good. And what about this vowel? That's right, eh. And a way to remember the eh sound is by pretending not to hear. So let's do that three times. Are you ready? Eh, eh, eh. Perfect. And what about this vowel? You're right, eh. And to remember the eh sound, we can pretend to cry. So let's do that three times. Are you ready? Eh, eh, eh. Good. And what about this vowel sound? What is this? That's right, uh. And to remember the uh sound, we can raise both of our arms above our head. Are we ready? Let's do it three times. Uh, uh, uh. Good. And last but not least, what about this sound? You're right, ah. And to remember the ah sound, we can open our mouth wide, take our pointer finger, and circle our open mouth. Let's do that three times. Are you ready? Ah, ah, ah. Excellent job with those vowels, boys and girls. Keep up the good work. Now we're going to review our sounds. Say our sounds with me. Mmm. Eh. T. D. A. K. G. E. N. B O R A W J Y X K Excellent job with those sounds, boys and girls. Now it's time to chain. So let's blend the sounds in this word. N, a, t, nut. So this word is nut. If we change the n to a b, our new word would be, that's right, but. And if we change the b to j, our new word would be, that's right, jut. And if we change the uh to eh, our new word would be, you got it, jet. And if we change the j to y, our new word would be, that's right, yet. And if we change the y to a o, our new word would be, that's right, let. And if we change the eh to ah, our new word would be, that's right, lot. If we change the a to i, our new word would be, lit, you're right. And if we change the u to k, our new word would be, kit, you got it. And if we change the t to d, our new word would be, Kid, excellent. Great job chaining. Pat yourselves on the back. Now we're going to review our tricky words. Say the tricky words with me. One, two, three, the, a, blue, Yellow, 
look. Excellent job with those tricky words. You're doing so good with reading. So now we're going to match the phrase with the picture. So let's see. Let's read the phrases. The first phrase says, bug on bed. And the next one here says, bug on rug. What is on the picture? That's right, bug on bed. So we're gonna put a check there, check. Now let's go down to the next one. Let's read the words here. Big van. Now down here, big jet. What's this a picture of? That's right, a big van. So we're going to check that off, check. Now let's go down here. Big jet. Big bug. What's this a picture of? That's right, a big jet. Check. And the last one. Let's read. Fan in box. Hat in box. Which phrase matches the picture? That's right, hat in box. Check. Great job matching. Okay, boys and girls, today we have a little test. But don't worry, you got this. So what I am going to do is I'm going to read some words to you. In your workbook, turn to assessment page 12.1. And if you do not have it, it's okay. You can write down the words on a blank sheet of paper and send it to your teacher. Now for this assessment, I want you to pause the video if you need to, okay? And you can always go back and re-listen. Take your time and do your best. Okay, so we're going to start up here at number one. We're going to do this one together, okay? Just so I can show you how it's done. So there are four words for each number. I'm going to say a word and you're going to circle the right answer. And if you don't have the page, you're going to write the right answer on your paper, okay? So number one is leg, leg. So you have to find the word leg and circle it or write it. And there it is. You see how I circled the word leg? That's what you're going to do throughout the whole test, okay? Or you're going to write the sounds O-E-G on your paper. Don't forget, pause the video if you need to, and you can always go back and re-listen. So now we're on number two. These ones you're going to do all by yourself. Number two, kid. Kid. Number three, rat. Rat. Number four, jug. Jug. Number five, yes. Yes. All right. These ones are all done, so you're going to turn the page in your workbook and go to the next page. And on your blank paper, you can just keep writing your answers down, okay? Now we're going to start at the top at number six. Number six, jet, jet. Number seven, log, log. Number eight, box, box. Number nine, web, web. And number 10, rug, rug. All right, I know you did an excellent job. Take pictures of your work and upload it to your portfolio for your teachers to see.
Great job today, everyone. Keep up the good work. I'm so proud of you.